What's up, everybody? I am so excited because not only is it fall, but it is finally time for fall fashion. Absolutely my favorite fashion topic to cover because it's jacket season, it's jean season, and in today's video, it is finally boot season again. So in this video, we are diving deep into the world of footwear, and I've got a battle between two boot brands that you're not gonna wanna miss. It's the TikTok approved Thursday boot company president boot versus the elegant, the sophisticated Beckett Simonon dollar boots. Both are very solid boots, but for the sake of today's video, only one can take the crown. All right, let's not waste any more time. First up, quality and durability. I've had my Thursday boot company president mocha boots for two whole years. And as you can see, they've held up extremely well and developed a beautiful patina. But here's the thing. The Beckett Simonon Dowler boots, they just feel sturdier. I mean, the leather, the stitching, it's almost as if through every stage of construction, the craftsmen at Beckett Simonon just put every ounce of love and passion into making these boots because straight out of the box, it's very evident. Now, here's the thing. My Thursday boot company president boots, I've had for two whole years. I've worn these in the mountains, I've worn these in the city, I've worn these in the summer, and I've worn these in the winter. And as you can see, they're still holding up. But if I'm comparing these boots side by side, I'm gonna have to say that Beckett Simonon takes the cake in construction, in quality and durability. I own multiple pair of Thursday Boot Company boots, as well as Beckett Simonon boots. So just comparing the totality of the brands and not just one specific boot from each, I have to say the stitching is far better on Beckett Simonon. The outsole construction is far better on Beckett Simonon. The overall material does feel better on Beckett Simonon. Okay, let's talk about sizing. And unfortunately, again, this one may not go too well for Thursday Boot Company. Because let's just say that purchasing a boot from Thursday Boot Company, when it comes to sizing, is almost like playing Russian roulette. Will you fit? Will you not fit? Who knows? But it depends. What does it depend upon? Is probably something similar to what you're asking me right now, or you're just telling me to get on with it. And I'm going to. So it depends on you. <laughs> That's a terrible answer, but it, it really does. Until sizing is completely fixed with Thursday Boot Company, it's going to continue to be an issue on a person-by-person -person basis. Now, here's what I went through. Two years ago, I order my Thursday Boot Company President Boots. I go to their website, and on the website, it specifically states, order half a size smaller than what you wear in sneakers. I wear an 11 and a half in sneakers. So I ordered an 11. I was following the brand's recommendation because they know their product and what should fit based on what they're telling me, right? You would think. So I get my 11 in. It was so tight that I couldn't fit my foot in it. Now again, this is two years ago, maybe it's fixed currently. Certain comments would lead me to believe that that's not the case. So I get on with customer service and we decided to order an 11 and a half. Great, probably what I should have worn to begin with. I get the 11 and a half in and it's a little too big. Now, I decided to keep it because I can wear a thicker pair of socks with it heavy duty kind of hiking socks, and they're fine. They fit, they're fine. A boot like this though, should fit a little snug on your foot in the beginning because as it breaks in, as it wears in, it's going to fit your foot beautifully. But now, because I have to wear thicker socks, my boot is a little bit bigger than what it should be. It's not the most comfortable boot to wear because of that. Now, a year after that, I decided I'm gonna try again. I ordered a pair of their Chelsea boots with the thick lug sole. I absolutely love Chelsea boots with a thicker, chunkier bottom. They 
rugged, they look resilient, they match the aesthetic that I'm going for, and I decided this time, you know what? I learned my lesson last time. I'm gonna order an 11 and a half in these. I get my boot in. The boot was so big, I couldn't wear anything with it that was going to fix it. It was big, it was clunky, it was uncomfortable, and that's when I stopped ordering from Thursday Boot Company. I ended up just getting rid of those boots. I just gave them away because I did not want to deal with it anymore. Sizing shouldn't be that big of an issue. On the other hand, Beckett Simonon seems to have gotten sizing absolutely spot on perfect. I wear an 11 and a half. They sent me an 11 and a half and they are a perfect fit. Now, one thing that you should know when you're ordering leather of this caliber, it's gonna be tight. It's gonna be rigid. It's gonna be a little uncomfortable until you break them in. And then you're gonna have the perfect boot. For those of you who like to know exactly what you're getting and you don't wanna be surprised by the sizing or the stitching, Beckett Simonon wins again. Now, to one of the categories that I think is extremely important, style and versatility. But I don't want to just talk about it in this video. I want to show you some outfits that I put together to really hammer in not only the versatility of these boots, but also their limitations. Again, I, I love the way that both of these boots look when, in my opinion, they're styled the way that they're supposed to be. But again, the versatility of the dollar boots is just insane. But I want to know from you, which boot are you going to choose or would you choose to carry you through all the challenges that any given day or week may present? Let me know in the comments below. Now for the final section, we're gonna be talking about the pricing of these two boots. Now, if the lower price is all that matters to you, Thursday Boot Company. These come in at $199. But if you have an extra $60 to spend, that's right, these come in at $259. And with the link and the discount code down below, you can get these boots at an even better price. Or any other shoe on Beckett Simonon's website, whether it's men or women's. Now, at $2.59 or with the discount, these are definitely the, the better choice. Now, I would assume the vast majority of you who are watching this video who have gotten to this point have been hearing things and you've come to the realization of, well, Seth, no shit that you're picking Beckett Simonon over Thursday Boot Company. You said you paid for Thursday Boot Company yourself and Beckett Simonon sent you these boots. That is 100% correct. Thursday Boot Company, I paid for those boots myself. Beckett Simonon did send me those boots and another pair for a video review, which I've already completed. Now, here is one thing that you should know about me. I have zero interest in maintaining brands on this page, and given the history of how many brands I no longer speak about, it's safe to say I don't mind losing a brand for telling the truth. If Beckett Simonon were shit boots, I would absolutely say that, or just send them back and never provide anything for them. If Thursday Boot Company sent me a pair of boots and said, please review these, 
I would and have said these exact same things. The sizing is garbage and I think they need to make their boots a little more exclusive. Maybe raise the prices or not produce as many as what they are. And I know that's not the point of a business, it's to make money, but what if businesses were different? This is, in reality, just my opinion and something I think is important to share. If you like this video, make sure to hit subscribe, hit the notification bell, we have videos coming out every week, and with fall season, we are ramping up video production because this is my favorite season to tell you about all of my favorite brands, all of my favorite clothes, and how to make a truly simplistic, but timeless and minimalistic closet. Thanks for watching.